Hi, it's Jim from Janku, and today I want to take a look at installing the newest version of GIMP on our Ubuntu 20.04 laptop. Now, I've tried to make this video in the past using the GIMP.org's installation instructions. So if you go to GIMP.org forward slash downloads, it tries to anticipate what your operating system is. So it's seeing here that I'm on an Ubuntu computer, and the instructions tell you to use Flatpak. Now, I've struggled with using this in the past, so I had a couple issues when I used Flatpak. I installed Flatpak on my Ubuntu system, and then I installed GIMP using the manual instructions here because the button was not working to open up my software center. And then it would install GIMP, but it had a lot of issues. The startup time was very slow, and the icons were incorrect, and then even finding and locating the launcher for the program was difficult. So I've been kind of frustrated with this experience. I've gone through the software center and used Snapcraft instead. Some of those packages come back a little outdated and have similar issues. So if you're like me, you've probably gone through this process several times where you've actually gone back through and you removed everything, including Flatpak, and you're stuck thinking, well, how do I get GIMP on my newest version of my Ubuntu laptop? Luckily, there's a PPA over here. So if you go to the Ubuntu Handbook, org website. There's some instructions about installing using the normal Ubuntu package manager, the apt git package manager. If you come down here, it first starts with this command to purge the previous PPA. So if you had an older version of GIMP on your computer, you might want to purge the old PPA since this is no longer where the new packages are coming from. So you can copy this command and paste it. I don't have GIMP installed on this computer. So I'm actually going to go to this first step here where I'm adding the new repository. I'm going to copy this. And let me just open up my terminal. So I'm going to type in terminal and open this up and bump up the size a little bit. And I'm going to paste that command in here. So we're going to sudo apt add this repository. I'm going to put my password for my computer in here and then I'll press enter to add it. And then you just want to make sure you update your package manager. So sudo apt update so you can recognize the new package. And then when your package manager is updated, you can come back here to the instructions. And now it says to update your package manager here, but we just did that. So you want to grab this line here to install GIMP in GIMP GMIC. So come back here and we'll type in that command and press enter. And then we'll say Y for yes. Once the installation process is complete, you can come back up here to your launcher and you can search for GIMP. And you should see the icon here and you can just select that. And then I'll just expand my GIMP program here. And if I go to help and about, you see that we're on GIMP 210.20. So that's the new version, that's great. And the startup was a reasonable amount of time, which is awesome. Now, if I wanna lock this to my launcher, I can just grab the icon here. And if you pull it off like this and you move it anywhere within your launcher here, it will automatically lock for future use. So if I put this here and I were to come and then close out of GIMP, you see that it stays here in my launcher and I can click it again to start it up again. So this installation process was much more seamless than the things I've tried in the past. Hopefully this helps you avoid some frustration as well. Big thanks to Jim down here for creating this PPA. Now, if you've already installed with Flatpak and it didn't go the way you want it, I'll put a link to this Ask Ubuntu forum there just so you can uninstall everything. So first you just wanna uninstall everything that Flatpak's installed. So you'd use this uninstall command and then you can just remove and purge Flatpak with these two commands here. Thanks for watching this tutorial. If it was helpful, please give it a thumbs up just so YouTube knows to share it with other folks and subscribe to our channel for more content like this in the future. All right, thanks, take care.